But then the second half started and we just continued the one, two, three, four, five. And then I think Pat maybe got fed up. Pat Stanton bursting through. Hello, one gets the impression that Hibs are just uh, easing up slightly and then there'll be another quick burst coming along soon. Stanton. Pat picked the ball up halfway line, runs forward, beats the keeper. It's going in, and we, Jimmy. Stole that one from Pat Stanton. Uh, I think the ball was, was going in the net. The Hibs fans were certainly cheering it before it hit the back of the net. Jimmy slid in to knock it into the back of the net. Some pal, eh? I'd have been delighted to have scored a goal at Tyne Castle that day. And for your best pal to go in and uh, put a damper on things. Uh, but I forgave him. I think it was Alan Anderson who was in his wake. And, and today, the centre half would have clipped Pat. 20 yards into their own half, but he didn't. Stanton. And Pat kept running and Pat kept running. And actually, I think his shot would have gone in. Beautiful goal, number six. Ten and a half minutes into the second half. Hearts nil, Hibernian six. I'm not sure if it would have gone in, because it was maybe not enough uh, speed on the ball, but... Uh, yeah, he made sure, that was the main thing, you know, but uh, there was one or two others who would have been a bit annoyed if they'd have done that, but uh, no, Jimmy was, it was okay with me with Jimmy.